Hi, right, it's you again today. Welcome back to another video. In this video today, we're just going to be talking about basically there is going to be a new insane update coming towards the Citra uh, emulator on Android smartphone. But I don't know when. I've been told by Tech Utopia. Stay tuned. It's soon. Apparently, there's a new update coming, and basically, it looks exactly like the Dolphin emulator, the layout. And apparently it's going to be really powerful, it's going to be fast, uh, and some games will be able to be playing at full speed. And if you look at the current Citra emulator, I'm going to go into a game, um, let's go Zelda. Apparently it's going to get a massive increase, but I'm not sure when it's coming out, but you can, down you can download the emulator, but you try and launch a game and nothing happens. And uh, oh, I've got the wrong setting. I've got the wrong setting on there. Sorry, let's just adjust the settings a minute. Turn that off. Uh, enable shaders. Uh, turn the VZ off. Right, let's come back out. Right, let's try again. See at the moment you get like 21 frames but apparently according to this update this will be able to be played at really high fps so you're looking for probably about 25 fps You can play uh, the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time on the N64 emulator if you really like that game rather than uh, relying on um, uh, the Citra Redis emulator. But some games, one or two games are playable at the moment fully on the Citra emulator. But apparently with this new update, a lot of the games are going to be made playable totally. So I don't know when, but stay tuned. According to Tech Utopia, it's not going to be very long away. So... Uh, yeah, so looking forward to that. Um, but yeah, so just that was just basically it is coming soon. This update will be coming soon, so stay tuned. Uh, and that's about it. So stay tuned for more videos, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.